Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and jump out on a limb here and say that most men, maybe even including you, because after all you clicked on this video, want to look stylish. But not really for anybody else, right? But for themselves and maybe their lady friend or partner. But with that said, sometimes looking stylish can get to be a little complicated because we start overthinking about color matching and what patterns go with what patterns. So today, I want to share five things that can make you look stylish but not only stylish, effortlessly stylish. Okay, but really quick, because I haven't asked for this in quite a while, my name's John, and if you're new here, and if you like videos that focus exclusively on lifestyle topics for men of over 40, that's pretty much all I do twice a week, please consider subscribing and join this community of incredible legends that show up here twice a week for brand new videos. Also, flip on the notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Okay, first things first, because it doesn't really matter what you're wearing if it looks like you just picked it up from a pile on your floor. So the first thing on my list is just to make sure that your clothes aren't wrinkled. So listen up, if you pull it out of your closet and you're standing there looking at it, asking yourself if it should be ironed, the answer is probably yes, it does. Because if you have to ask, it does. So one thing you can do is just toss that thing in the dryer for a couple minutes to help relax out the wrinkles. Another thing you can do is to bust out the iron or the steamer and just go to town. Or you can use a wrinkle release spray. And that might be the fastest way to get it done because all you do really is just spray the stuff on, pull it out tight and let it dry for a couple minutes. Now, this isn't gonna give you that crisp iron look, but it does work pretty darn well. And if you wanna try some of this stuff that I've been using lately, I'll link to it down below. Okay, up next is to wear monochromatic outfits. So wearing similar colors looks effortless because you didn't have to match anything. And it looks like you just grabbed a few pieces out of your closet and just walked out the door. And it looks stylish because, well, it is. Wearing similar colors is a great way to look slimmer, taller, and a little more expensive. Now, navy blue might be the easiest and also my favorite, but also try brown. If you missed the video I made a little while ago showing a bunch of different ways to wear brown, I'll link to it right up here and also down below. All right, this brings us to my next item, which is fit. And I'm sure you're probably tired of hearing everybody talk about fit and making sure that your clothes fit you properly. And that's because it's probably the single most important thing that you can do to look your best and also effortlessly stylish. I've talked about this a lot in a bunch of other videos, but you can take two identical guys with one wearing baggy clothes and the other guy wearing well-fitting clothes. So you tell me which guy looks more stylish. This can not only be applied to your suits, but to your everyday items and even your casual clothes. But just remember, well-fitting does not mean tight. I mean, the last thing I want you to do is run around looking like a stuffed sausage. So maybe start thinking about the large instead of the extra large size. And instead of getting the classic fit shirts or the relaxed fit pants, try the slim fit or tapered options and go from there. It's probably not gonna be as weird as you might think. Okay, the next item on my list to help you look effortlessly stylish is to wear nicer shoes. Again, I've mentioned this a bunch before. So listen, if you're a sneaker guy, wear nicer sneakers. If you're a slip-on guy, wear nicer loafers or drivers. Shoes are very easy because, for example, a nice pair of medium brown brogues go with just about everything. They look stylish, they look nice, and it's just a super easy grab. So your effortless style meter just went to 10. But look, I get it, right? There's a ton of really nice looking athletic sneakers on the market right now, and casual seems to be king at the moment, but that doesn't mean you have to settle. Now, maybe you've got wide feet and running shoes just feel better for you. Companies like Allen Edmonds, for example, make a ton of wide sizes. They've got everything from dress shoes to loafers to casual slip-ons and even sneakers. So if your goal is to look stylish, you might wanna consider leaving your gym shoes or your running shoes at home every so often, and trying to go for something a little nicer. Coming in next is to know the color wheel and use it to help you match colors. And yes, I realize that I said earlier that matching colors can get a little complicated, but hear me out. There are several different ways to use the color wheel and I'll link to the one that I like to use down below. But I would suggest for the sake of keeping it simple to focus on complementary and triadic colors. Play around with this and mess with the shades and the colors to figure out what colors go together that you might already have in your wardrobe. And the reason why this works in effortless style is incorporating colors that match well is visually appealing to the eye. 
the brain receives a signal and says, yeah, I like that. And there isn't too much additional thought other than maybe like, yeah, that guy looks great. I'm not sure what it is, but he looks good. And it doesn't even have to be with your nice clothes, right? You can use this with a t-shirt and jeans or a polo shirt and a pair of shorts. If you wanna go check this color wheel out, I'll put the link down below. And with that, as always, I wanna thank you for watching. And if you wouldn't mind clicking that like button, I would appreciate it because it helps more people see this video who might need to see it. Live well, my friends, and I'll see you in the next one.